This is Dante Williams. Are you watching? Dante's. 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 Boxing Nation. This is Showtime Sean Porter. Filipino Flash, Jesse Burgess. This is Al Bernstein. You're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. I am sure we're ready to check Shane. Search over the last name, Morgan. Dante's. 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 Boxing Nation. Boom, 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 boom. Yo, this is Deontay the Bronze from the Wilder. My name is Gennady Golovkin. And you're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. Hi, this is Julian Jackson, and this is Dante Boxing Nation. This is Julian Jackson, and you're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. <laughs> All right. Dante's Boxing Nation. Very good. Very good. San Antonio. All right, Dante's Boxing Nation. I'm over here, one of the hottest prospects. You guys are going to be hearing a lot about this man. Real soon, my man Mario Barrios. What's going on, man? How's it going, brother? All right. Now, you just did about eight rounds of sparring right now. What else you got lined up today? Uh, we just finished up some, some good rounds of sparring, and then um, later on, probably we'll get, get another workout in. Mm -hmm. uh, we're, we're grinding to, to the night. I see. I see. It looked like you were still ready to go. You had a lot of energy. Assess um, your sparring today. Oh, we did good. And, um, we're finding a shorter opponent, you know, so we're working on keeping them on the outside. You know, we had a, had a tough, tough, short opponent today you know, who, who's, who's really working on getting the inside. And that's what, what we're, um, we're really trying to avoid right now. You know, we're trying to get, keep with our game plan, you know, fighting smart. Keep them on the outside. Now, you say you got a shorter opponent, but everybody's going to be shorter than you. <laughs> you six foot tall fighting at 130. I mean, that you almost like a little modern day. Tommy Hearns almost, you know, so yeah. is, is that like one of the fighters you guys actually study, you know, having that type of height advantage over all your opponents? Because you're used to being taller than everyone, right? Yeah. Obviously, right? Definitely. I mean, growing up, I mean, um, I was ever a taller fighter, but man, like after, after I turned 17, I, I got a growth spurt out of nowhere, you know, so then the, the, that's when we started studying, you know, taller fighters, you know, the, 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 the Hitman Hearns, you know, he was one, one of the main ones we were studying. Janeiro Hernandez, you ever, you ever, um, Watch him, never watch him. Like, he was a good champion, real tall at 135 too, man. That's what it is, man. So who was some of your favorite fighters growing up? Who who inspired you the most? Uh, growing up, I mean, um, one, of the, one of the fighters that we got uh, our nickname from is um, the Golden Boy. Um, my manager, yeah, my manager, he, he gave me that name. Um, I mean, starting off, you know, we had a similar start. You know, we were, we were some fighters for the weight class, and so we both started around 122. Mm -hmm. And now I'm playing 130, but I mean, I, I still have the height advantage on everybody. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's good, man. That's good. Tell everybody about the fight you have uh, lined up next week. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, next week, um, July 9th, fighting a um, tough Italian veteran, um, Davis Bashiro. Uh, we're fighting for the, the, the uh, number two IBF spot. And I mean, it's, it's going to be a great fight. I mean, we know Bashiro's coming, we know with the experience. And uh, we're, we're the, the younger fighter trying to take the stage from prospect to contender. I mean, we're, like I said, we're just grinding. You know, we're, we're getting ready for it. Uh huh. And that's going to be on PBC on ESPN, right? Yeah, PBC on ESPN. That's nice. Nice, man. Now, how soon do you see yourself? Now, you said this is already a title eliminator battle. So yeah. you see yourself fighting for a title pretty soon then, right? Oh, definitely. I mean, we've been putting in the hard work. I mean, me and my team, we, we both feel that, that I'm ready to, to take this step towards the title. And like I said, I mean, well, right now we're just taking uh, one fight at a time. Do you know anything about him, your opponent? You know uh, anything about him? I said, well, we, we know he's a, he's a real tough veteran fighter. He's a short fighter. He, he fights the, the, the short man fight. You know, he tries to get inside, inside and work. Yeah. And like I said, that's what, um, that's what we're going to try to avoid. Okay. That's what it is. Any other fighters around your division that you think maybe in the future, like, wow, that would be a huge fight if me and so-and-so matches up down the line? Oh, uh, man, just everybody, you know, 130s, uh, as of right now, everybody at 130 needs to watch out. Then, um, I mean, depending on how long we stay here, I mean, uh, I'm only 21, uh, um, 130 pounds, you know, so, I mean, um, I mean, we plan on being here for a while, but, I mean, uh, there's, there's no doubt that we're going to be moving up to 35, 40. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, there's a lot of good fights for you. You signed with Al Heyman, and, you know, he has a huge roster, so it's a lot of good matches out there for oh, you, man. man. All right, man. Well, thanks for your time. Anything else you want to say to the fans, man? Uh, I don't want to thank my fans, uh, my team, you know, my advisor, Al Heyman, my manager, Luis Cubis Jr., Bob Santos, um, Dante's Boxing Nation. Thank you for all the love, brother. Right. Sure. Thank you, everybody. Sure. All right. Thanks for your time. Mario Barrios, guys. watching Dante's Boxing Nation.